I'm Monique, I am the director of Animal Farm. I'm Lily Ashton and I'm the producer of Animal Farm. Yeah, we kind of took on this quite big piece and we're just trying to make it our own really. Um, we've decided to set it in a mining context um, in the 80s up north and um, yeah, it's kind of our take on it. Um, that you're coming to a production or hopefully come to a production that isn't based on animals at all. We've kind of made these real people, real life um, situations where um, their economic situation has been taken from them by the removing of the mines and kind of they're, they're creating these, the windmill and they're creating this community of Animal Farm because this is all they've got. I think we all came like cast and crew to this with an idea of what Animal Farm is. It's kind of it's a it's a story that has a lot of anxieties that can come from from any time, any direction, any place. Um, and it meant that it was quite actually quite easy um, to transfer like a fable onto a new context. We've been really lucky. We've been working with some really great people, whether it's from set or music or projections. Um, we really wanted to create a concept. It's quite a bare stage. Like when you come, you'll see it. There's not really much going on in terms of you know naturalistic setting. But we tried to through costume and just the way it's kind of portrayed and the way we've characterised the characters to show people that you know that are real life and quite current. And you know the mining strikes didn't happen too long ago. It was in the 80s, so it's it's quite relevant. And you know you're kind of seeing a lot of the things that are happening back then be happening now. Yeah, and um, when I came to the script, I, we noticed it's very narrative based and it's heavy and we've actually changed it into the first person. So we hope that even though it's something, it's a form of storytelling, we hope that that can also be internalised back into the characters. Just in terms of the politics of it as well, like it's, it, it's not an anxiety of like a right wing kind of fear or anything, it's, it's, it's an anxiety of an ideology taking over and becoming so big that it it can't be controlled and it does become corrupt and kind of rotten. Um, and I think that's something that in Animal Farm is really good from the basis of like the original Orwell story. It's not, it's not a politicised piece in any terms of like left or right. Mm -hmm. it's, it's something that comes. Yeah. Yeah. The very next morning, the chap came, took out, came racing in with the news that Frederick and his men had come through the gate. There were fifteen men with half a dozen guns. They opened fire as soon as they got within fifty yards. The animals took refuge in the farm buildings and they peeped out from the chinks and knot holes. The entire pasture, including the windmill, was in the hands of the enemy. Right. They're going to knock the windmill down! Impossible, comrades! They could knock them over over a week. Courage, comrades! But the men were drilling a hole in the base of the windmill. Slowly, and with an air of amusement, Benjamin nodded his long muzzle. I thought so. Nice, okay, let's skip. So what is that man fighting for? Squealers' figures invariably demonstrated that things were getting better and better and better. Only old I professed to knowing that things never had been nor ever could be much better or much worse. Hunger, hardship and disappointment are the unalterable laws of life. I think people should come and see Animal Farm because it is different. It's not what you would come in and expect. We've really tried to put a different spin on it. Um, talented, talented actors and really we've really focused this time because we did a production before last year and we've really focused on making an actual production like in terms of the music and the set and the projections we've really you know we've been more technical than we were before and so hopefully you'll come and actually see like a complete performance that you know we're kind of proud of and, yeah. Animal Farm is on the 30th of November, the 1st and the 2nd of December. It's in the Northern Quarter at the Ziffer Black Cafe. Um, and it's at 7.30, so definitely come down and have a look at what 